Greetings. I'm here today to tell you do not give up. I know how hard it is. The Word of God tells us that there are other believers around the world going through the same thing. Okay? So I'm here to say do not give up. No matter what you're facing, I get it. I understand, you know, we face the world, the world, ourselves, and the devil. You know, I get it. But I'm here to tell you, God is faithful. Remain true to Him. He will come through. I'm talking to myself, too. Do not give up. Fight the good fight. Stay in the Word. Remember who our God is. He is a strong and mighty warrior. He has dominion and power over everything in heaven and everything on earth. Okay? Jesus Christ and Him crucified is the main thing that we need to hold on to. Okay? Keep believing, keep praying, keep fasting, okay? If that is what it takes just for you to stay in the Holy Spirit, just for you to stay in the faith, sometimes that's what it takes for me. That is what it takes for me sometimes just to hang in there, to stay in the faith, to stay in the Holy Spirit. Spirit, you know, pray that God renews you in every way, renews your faith, renews your fire within. Do not give up. I want to give up sometimes. You know, I say, I am throwing in the towel. This is too hard. <laughs> but I do not do that because I remember Jesus, who he is. That is what matters, not other people, what other people say, you know. It is Jesus. Remember, Adonai Elohim, our eternal God. Remember heaven, okay? Remember, of course, the most important, Jesus. He is, like I said, he is a strong and mighty warrior, okay? He's coming soon. Ask him to fight your battles. Remember, he's coming soon. Stay connected to the truth of God's word. So important. With so many things coming at us to bring us down. We need to remember who our God is. He is faithful. Okay? He is holy, He is righteous, He is strong, He is mighty, He is all-powerful, all okay? He has dominion over everything on earth, everything we go through, everything in heaven. Jesus Christ and His blood shed for us, there is nothing He cannot accomplish. Nothing is impossible for those who believe no matter what you're going through, no matter what the doctors say, no matter what the situation, even if it seems hopeless, our God, there's nothing too hard for Him. Put your hope in Jesus Christ. Not in your circumstances, not in what others are saying or doing, not what it looks like, not in money. Money is, I'm not, I'm not knocking, believe me. I, you know, I prefer a lot. <laughs> you're blessed if you're wealthy, you're blessed. Money is a tool in God's hand. I'm not knocking money. But the, the root of evil is the love. So don't put your hope in that. Um,
put your hope in Jesus Christ and Him crucified, okay? Hang in there, man. I'm telling you, I know how it is. Especially, I can relate, people of God. I can relate to any of you who have a, this, uh, a disease that limits your, your life. I, I I understand, but I'm telling you, put your hope, your faith, stand strong in your faith, okay? Be a mighty warrior for God. Be a mighty warrior. Know who you are. Know who you are. Keep praying. Keep knocking. Keep seeking. Keep asking, okay? And that door is going to be knocked down. You, okay, you keep believing for your healing. Do whatever you can. Do you know that you can reverse diabetes? Yes. There is a book out. Uh, it's, it's been out for a while. It is, it's the Atkins diet. Through the Atkins, okay? You know, of course, go to your doctor and make sure everything is good. But, you can reverse it. Some people just don't want to go through what you have to do. I understand. Mine is neurological. You know, but I am continuing in my faith and believing His promises are true every single day. You know, it's a battle. It is, I have to agree, I understand, I can relate. It is an uphill battle, I understand, but God is able. Do not give up on your faith, okay? I pray God will increase your faith tremendously. I decree and declare in the name of Jesus, you will receive your healing and so will I. In the name of Jesus, I decree and declare a new life for you and me. I decree and declare blessings. Chase us down. The favor of God chases us down. We are healed. We are made whole by the blood of Jesus and nothing can stop it. In the name of Jesus, keep your faith, people of God. I hope this is an encouragement to you. So, I love you. I'll talk to you soon. Keep on keeping on. Keep fighting the good fight. Okay? Jesus loves you. Keep Jesus number one. Okay? Praise God. And keep Jesus number one. I love you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Comment. Bye.